Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. Joining us this morning from the Saginaw County Health Department is Chris Harrington and Dr. Delisha Pruitt. Thank you both for joining us this morning. We appreciate you being here. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Of course. Okay, so today we are talking about hand washing, and that is so important right now. So first tell us about the connection between hands and the spread of the coronavirus. Well, hands and the spread of coronavirus, you can get coronavirus um, from surfaces. It can get on your hands. And so we tell people to wash your hands with soap and water and also use hand sanitizer, a gel base, 60% uh, more alcohol to uh, help stop the spread of COVID-19. And you know what, doctor, people don't really realize that there really is a secret to hand washing. Talk to us about that. What, what's the secret? Well, it's really not a secret. And okay, we Chris. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we, we really need folks to, um, to, to, to know how to properly wash yes, their hands. Yes, we do. A lot of people think like, oh, I know how to wash my hands. And then we all know that if you actually go in and time yourself for 20 seconds, um, then do you, really, uh, do you really wash your hands for that period of time? And so what we're finding is that people typically don't. So it's not really a secret. We don't want it to be a secret. Right. Effective hand washing is really 20 seconds with running water mm -hmm. and soap. Those are the three things that you need. You wet your hands. You put the soap on, you lather and scrub, and you rinse it off. I mean, it's simple strategies and simple steps to hand washing. It really is. It seems so simple, but so why doesn't everyone do it? <laughs> Well, Colette, you know, a lot of times people give excuses like the knobs are dirty on oh, the sink yeah. or they're really rushy and I got to get to go somewhere or they don't want to touch the toilet after they use it because it could be dirty. There's no good reason why you shouldn't wash your hands. Right. Washing your hands prevents diseases and it prevents you giving diseases to yourself and to your loved one and your other neighbors and people around you. And I think this is going to really help. Tell us about the three W's, why are they so important? What are they, the three W's? Yeah, the three W's is our campaign for COVID right now, but really could be applied for the prevention of any disease. So our three W's is to wash your hands, that's the first W. The second W is to watch your distance. So socially, physically distancing, as we know that's really important right now during COVID. The third W is to wear your mask. So wash your hands, wash your distance, and wear your mask. And really, we just recently found out that the CDC made their changes in terms of what a direct close contact is currently now for COVID-19. So now, if you accumulate 15 minutes of direct close contact where you're less than six feet from someone, you really can be considered a close contact and that puts you into a higher risk category for contracting COVID-19. So we really want folks to know that that close interaction of less than six feet is really key. Whether it's three minutes, five minutes, 10 minutes at a time, when we add that up over a 24 hour period, that can put you into that direct close contact category. So if people don't want to be quarantining and don't want to be put into that category, watch your distance. That's Stay right. Stay more than six feet away. I love you're it. You're wearing your mask and you wash your hands prevention strategies at work. Okay, so now that folks are listening to the importance of hand washing and doing it more, what can we expect to see this upcoming flu season? Well, if you wash your hands and keep your hands clean, you can expect to have a reduction of the number of respiratory illnesses, including COVID-19, including the flu, and including hepatitis A. So it's really important for us to wash our hands and keep our hands clean. They looked at 16 schools and over 6,000 students, and they found that when the students use uh, hand sanitizers in the classroom, it reduced the overall rate of absenteeism wow. by 19.8%. So it's really important for us to continue to be diligent um, about washing our hands. Love it, the three W's, wash your hands, watch your distance and wear your mask. Thank you both for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And thank you again for watching. You can find more information in the hot link section of WNEM.com.